because I had to hitchhike my ass home too. And the first time I attempted this feat, now I, I, I was pretty, you know, hitchhiking was one of my best things. I was kind of a hitchhiking motherfucker. I, I, uh, but I, the first time I went home, I had a, I, I literally had a, a truck drop me off at the Shirts Texas exit on Interstate 35. Now, my parents no longer lived in Church, Texas. We were renters and we moved around a little bit and they were living on the, the northwest side of San Antonio by that time. But the truck dropped me off there and I decided that it was like a God thing and I was wrong. Um, I decided to go in and check out my old stomping grounds and you know, and I found out very quickly that no one in Church, Texas remembered me except the police. They were in the... Um, Christmas spirit, however, they um, they gave me a place to stay. <laughs> and uh, something to eat, wasn't Christmas, you know, wasn't turkey and dressing or nothing, but it was, you know. And after um, exacting a small ransom from my father, they released me later, and so I did make it home for Christmas morning. And, uh, I did get this song out of the deal. B, right? Let it be anywhere. Alright. But I did get this song out of the deal, but I don't think it was worth it. Right. It's just not that good a song. And... But for whatever it's worth, it is the hometown blues with apologies to Thomas Wolfe and Doc Watson. One, two, three.